क्वेश्चन इज गिवन वन अपॉन टू पावर एक्स इज इक्वल टू एक्स पावर सॉरी एक्स अपॉन एट सो वी हैव टू फाइंड आउट द वैल्यू ऑफ एक्स हियर हाउ वी कैन फाइंड आउट द वैल्यू ऑफ एक्स लेट सी सोल्यूशन वन अपॉन टू पावर एक्स इज इक्वल टू एक्स अपॉन एट दिस इज क्वेश्चन सो वी कैन राइट दिस वन अपॉन एक्स डिवाइडेड बाई टू पावर एक्स वी आर सेपरेटिंग पावर हेयर सो वन अपॉन एक्स डिवाइडेड बाई टू पावर एक्स इज इक्वल टू एक्स पावर एट ना वन अपॉन एक्स सो इट विल बिकम वन डिवाइडेड बाई टू पावर एक्स इज इक्वल टू एक्स अपॉन एट नाउ मल्टीप्लाय बोथ साइड बाय टू पावर एक्स सो मल्टीप्लाय both sides by 2 power x then we will get 2 power x times 1 upon 2 power x is equal to x upon 8 times 2 power x now 2 power x 2 power x cancel so it will become 1 is equal to x upon 8 times 2 power x now we have to remove this 8 so we can multiply both side by 8 so multiply both sides by 8 then we will get 8 times 1 is equal to x upon 8 times 8 times 2 power x now 8 times 1 that is 8 is equal to this 8 is cancel from 8 so x times 2 power x or we can say x time 2 power x is equal to 8 now uh, according to lambert w fun function according to lambert w function a e power a is equal to a so we can say e power ln of a is equal to a and e power e power ln of 2 is equal to 2 this is equation number 1 so e power ln of 2 is equal to 2 this is equation number 2 and uh, equation 1 you can consider this one x time 2 power x is equal to 8 this is equation 1 so now we are substituting value of equation 2 in equation 1 so equation 1 is x times 2 power x is equal to 8 now substitute this is equation 1 now substitute value of equation Two in one. Now, question two. This is e power n of two is equal to two. So we have to substitute this value here. So x times two is e power n of two. E power n of two. Power x. So power x here. Power x is equal to eight. Right now. we can write this x times e power ln of 2 is equal to 8 x times e power ln of 2 and this x so we can say this is x ln 2 x ln 2 is equal to 8 now we can multiply both side by ln 2 now multiply both side by ln of 2 so we will get ln of 2 times x times e power x ln of 2 is equal to ln of 2 times 8 right now this one we will take here so x ln of 2 times e power x ln of 2 is equal to 
times ln of 2. Now, x ln of 2 times e power x ln of 2 is equal to. Now, this is 8. So, we can write 4 times 2, 4 times 2 ln of 2. So, it will become 4 times 2 ln of 2. Therefore, we can say x ln of 2 times e power x ln of 2 is equal to 4. Now, ln of 2, so it will uh, uh, come become uh, at this side. So, it will become ln of 2 power 2. So, 4 times ln of 2 power 2. Because we know the formula m times ln of p is equal to ln of p power m right so using this formula here for ln of 2 power 2 now x ln of 2 times e power x ln of 2 is equal to now 4 times ln of 2 power 2 that is 4 4 times ln of 4 now this 4 times ln of 4 so ln of 4 here and this is 4 so this 4 we can write this 4 we can write e power ln of 4 is equal to 4 so using this we will uh, write here e ln of 4 uh, uh, times ln of 4 in next step that is x ln of 2 times e power x ln of 2 is equal to uh, in place of this 4 we can write e ln of 4 times ln of 4 this one ln of 4 now x ln of 2 times e power x ln of 2 is equal to e ln of 4 times ln of 4 now we are applying here lambert w function so we will get here applying lambert w function we will get here w of x ln of 2 times e power x ln of 2 is equal to w of e ln of 4 times ln of 4. Now, x ln of 2, x ln of 2 times e x ln of 2. So, we can write this. According to Lambert W function, we can write this x ln of 2 is equal to ln of 4. This one ln of 4. Right? Now, x ln of 2 is equal to ln of 4. So, this 4 we can write 2 square. Now, x ln of 2 is equal to. Now, this uh, power come this side. So, 2 ln of 2. Now, Divide both sides by ln of 2. Divide both sides by ln of 2. Because we have to find out the value of x. That's why we are dividing here with ln of 2. So, x ln of 2 divided by ln of 2 is equal to 2 ln of 2 divided by ln of 2. Now, ln of 2, ln of 2 cancel here. So, we will get here and this one also cancel. So, we will get here x is equal to 2. This is the value of x. Now, let's verify is this correct or not. Let's verify. So, question is 1 upon 2 power x is equal to x upon 8. This is question and we have to verify uh, verify for value of x that is 2. So, if x is equal to 2. So, 1 upon 2 power x. x is 2 question mark x power 8. So, 2 power 8. Now, 1 square divided by 2 power 2 question mark 2 upon 8. Now, 1 square that is 1, 2 power 2 that is 4, question mark, 2 upon 8. So, 1 upon 4, question mark, uh, 2 1 ja 2, 2 4 ja 8, 1 upon 4. So, we can say 1 upon 4 is equal to 1 upon 4, where LHS is equal to RHS. So, value of x 
is equal to 2. This is correct solution for this equation. Thank you.